blessings to the families, the king, the queens, and the gods. Apparently, Alpo, alleged killer, has been caught. And I do say alleged killer because this whole thing is a wild, wild goose chase at this point. When he say, she say. But let's fast forward the news and y'all hit the like button in the comment sections and we get this started the right way. Notification bell to everybody in the building. Make sure you hit that and we start it off the right way by clicking that like button. Salute kings and queens and the gods. So Alpo Martinez killer allegedly has been told by us that he's been caught signed sealed and delivered according to what street justice is saying out here now they're saying it was apparently over a female a lady companion that was in the situations you feel me with alpo and another former associate that's not from dc not from harlem not from the, that area at all and not neither of an employee of alpo now what they're saying about this situation is you know the street legend was killed for a woman it was reported uh that alpo had been shot in harlem you know exclusively what we know now is that the police believe they have captured his killer i find it funny that the police is the ones who saying it even though allegedly we feel they're the culprits in a lot of this but let's say allegedly just not to disparage anything or situation now we have some idea of the motive behind the murder of the legendary drug dealer in Harlem according to a lot of news sources and reports out here the it was not rich Porter men's like I told you or none of that you feel me now what happened was Paul returned to the game selling drugs according to them the bag he threw out the window when he was shot were testers he regularly took one hundred thousand dollars in payments to harlem and brooklyn and was a plug this is allegedly according to an inside source alpo lived in the same life he lived in the 1980s and 90s and he had a lot of people in harlem living in fear here's more anyone who was called who called him a rat he basically you know pressed and back down he would force them to take pictures with him and even give in to some rappers pause bro so how did he manage to move and shake harlem after bringing so much here's what we also heard many of other street figures in that era felt that pole bigger than life you feel me was gonna get his way regardless they never brought them up they vouched for him. Alpo told allegedly the Federals he would not give information about anyone from Harlem. You know what I mean? Poe was doing all this at 55. He was in great shape and did not drink, smoke, nor take any drugs that anybody was aware of. You know what I mean? So who killed Alpo was the big question. Now, according to, you know, NYPD, police have detained a Bronx, a Bronx man, that is, and plan to charge him with Alpo's death. Now, I'm going to give my opinion on all this, but let me continue reading the news. They're going to charge the dude in Alpo's death. Police have collected video footage from cameras near the scene, and they say the images link to the murder. You feel me? The images is their suspect who they have in custody and the motive of the alleged killer they've learned in the streets that alpo was sleeping with the girlfriend of a 20 year old man and when a young man confronted alpo for in infidelity alpo slapped the man <laughs> this awesome south central movie type is you know what i look like gonna go ask a man is you sleep with my girl look if you sleep with my girl she's your girl now she's not mine anymore i'm not asking no man no question about you know educational purpose sleeping with my girl because it's not my girl now the exclusive report is that you know you visited the area and the guy knew where alpo's you know whereabouts would be where he chills at and people was cool with this apparently let's not forget that part that i really want to say people was cool with alpo coming down the block doing his thing you know being in the midst of everywhere nobody had problems with alpo doing any of this i don't know man this news is getting kind of weirder and weirder at the moment i'm trying to make sense of it i'm looking at alpo who's over here even Mano was praising the killers of alpo and i felt like look first of all rest in peace 
you know, to Diamond Seal. You know, I don't know that guy at all. I know he was an alleged, you know, drug member. Friends of a lot of these folks over here. He was allegedly killed by Alpo prior to Alpo. You feel me? Being incarcerated for the 1991 case. And now, all these years later, you know, Mano saying what he's saying is it's kind of weird i'm gonna be real and honest you praising all this is cool i'm not mad at him for that but why didn't you do it if you felt all these hostilities towards alpo why not you go take up the badge of honor to go do what you had to do i'm just being honest with all of y'all you feel me i'm being honest with all of y'all for a lot of these people to sit and do what they do i don't know and i know domino was allegedly mayno's family member you feel me so i don't want to be mean or say anything i understand you gotta love your family but if you got this energy after the big bad wolf dies and allegedly if the cops is saying it's not even anybody that alpo did anything wrong to it was a dude over at tatiana which i don't believe we'll, we'll share and talk about that a little bit later as well now alpo being the big bad man that he got the whole areas shook of i felt like if dudes is talking brazy now why not just go make you know things shake for that man for real because it just get very weird man i'm just like i'm sitting back here and i'm like everybody had the chance of doing everything that they had to do why wasn't this done why now i have to sit back and see everybody talking all brave people's going out the way it, it's just crazy not only that if you're friends and families you would want to know who actually killed Alpo too. You don't want to know that it was just, you don't care that he died, but you would like to know. So the fact that you see a situation where, how do I say in a clear light? You see a situation where people are pinpointing and celebrating, but it's like, they're saying that post still won because it wasn't nobody he did anything wrong to. And let's pretend if it was a dude you know, who was jealous and mad over him being slapped and Alpo getting his girl. Let's pretend it's even that. Why would it, you know, not generate anger that you didn't get your lick back? Why not generate anger that this man who did what he did, he still even died in the way that he wanted to live? So I, I, I don't know, man. You guys tell me if I'm thinking over this far a bit too much, it, it's whole you know being served his karma what, what what was it man all i'm reporting is what they're telling us they arrested the culprit they got the personnel everything should be changed done and everything should be good you know the whoop the wham bam whatever you call it look man y'all tell me in the comment sections what you think of all this and remember we can't see your dislike button so do our best if you have anything you want to critique or support Make sure you comment in the comment section because YouTube is not playing with dislikes no more. As you guys can see, it's not us, it's YouTube. Look, love your family, love your kids, and stay blessed, gang.